Hi everyone, now let me just like lower you guys. What's up everyone? How's everybody doing? We're in week five. Woohoo! Exciting stuff. We've passed, we've surpassed the one month of being on testosterone, which ultimately means we are now going to start in the yogurt and I'm like spitting the yogurt like left and right, which means now we are going to progress and we're gonna notice changes. I just finished out working out legs. All right, I switched up angles because I feel like, you know, with the camera being so close to my face, it was too bright because I got my I got my lighting going on. I'm gonna show you what I'm making for lunch because for the last month or so, this has been my absolute favorite every single day meal that I like to make, you know, afternoon when I'm, you know, fully awake. So I'm making three whole eggs and I make like an egg sandwich, but I, I love buying cold cuts. Uh, my favorite are, you know, like chicken breasts, but I got the toilet's acting up. Looks like I ain't going for a while, but, um, sorry, I heard noises, but chicken breasts, but I got like, a, like a tomato basil, like one. So it's more flavorful. I'm going to pop my toast in the toaster and get that ready for when I cook my eggs. Darn, like it's burning. Um, and I still have to cut my cheese. Ah, I am so so excited. I wish I had filmed the phone call yesterday because I feel like that would have been interesting for people to know what the rules are, you know, in different parts of Canada. But I am going to Vancouver tomorrow, British Columbia. Things are kind of like fully back into place there. So I was on the phone with one of their local gyms yesterday downtown and I was like, do you guys do walk-ins? I know it's kind of, you know, there might be restrictions to that because of COVID. And she goes, no, 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 we have a 200 person capacity, like limit capacity, which I was like, Boom, like we only had 10 people here a month ago. I was like, okay, amazing. Like what, what's the deal with walk-ins? And she goes, yeah, we do walk-ins. She goes, we don't really ever fill up to capacity. I wouldn't assume so, because 200 people, like if you gather that, that's a lot of people. And I'm there for four days. So I was like, I'm, I'm gonna take advantage of, you know, the gyms. Obviously I'm gonna take precautions. I'm gonna be super careful, I promise. This Vancouver trip was very last minute. So this is what the outcome looks like. Keep in mind, I had eggs also this morning for breakfast. I had, I think three again. So this is six. I have two pieces of toast. So we got our carbs in. I have a side egg here. You know, I put a little cheese just to add flavor. As you can see here, like ooey gooey wowzers. Um, you've got the toast bread and then I have um, you know, chicken on the bottom there, as you can see, this is the chicken breast, the, the tomato basil one. It's so nice. And then you got egg, you know, and then I got another piece of chicken on top, and then I got egg, and then I top it up with a little, like a little uh, pepper. This shall do up until dinner. Like, wow, wow! I should work at a restaurant. Next. Hello. I leave for British Columbia tomorrow, and with that being said, I need to take my dose of testosterone early for the week because obviously I can't bring my my tools, my equipment with me, like on the plane imagine like i have this like in my bag accidentally and like i get stopped by security and they're like sir what's that and i'm like don't worry i gotta get big and strong baby i take two doses of testosterone twice a week so i pre-filled my syringe i have my alcohol pads with me and then i'm gonna take anavar because i have to take my anavar for today and i also have to take my anastrozole today so that is super totally damn bombastic exciting woo i am gonna go do the deed and i am gonna come back and I'll take my Anavar and my Anastrozole with everybody. I'm having a little bit of a tiny, 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 tiny bit of bleeding right here. Yeah, there it is. So I'm gonna get around to taking my Anastrozole. As you can see, they're, they're just tiny little tablets. I take them in halves because one a week for myself has been working. And then because I also haven't taken my Anavar, I'll take my Anavar, one Anavar. I just wanted to inform everybody that I am at the airport. I am headed out to Vancouver for, I think we were there for four or five days. But I wanted to inform everybody that I will be hitting the gyms over there. So I'll be filming a lot of content of like me working out. I already got in contact with one of the gyms. They have like a whole membership thing ready for me to go there for the weekend, like a trial thing, which is amazing. And I can't wait to take advantage of all the benefits that steroids provides. And you know, I can finally hit the gym and I can finally test out my strength. So let's go, bud. All right. Hey guys, we're just here at Business 
claws, you know. We had to have dinner tonight. Yvonne didn't like the chicken because she said it was rubber. It was chewy, rubbery I chicken. I loved it. And it was tasted so... like the bottom of a shoe, so George went... <laughs> so I ate her meal. George is really like wanting to be chest right now. He's sleeping and he's really enjoying himself. Yvonne, huh? Yes. What are the chances of us getting on one of the mountains and jumping off? Hey guys, so here we have in Vancouver, just touched down. George is working on his lunges right in the city and lunch. Bro, we're like in Vancouver, like trying to get fit, working on our fitness. Yes. Our first meal of the trip. It's a little monster. <laughs> is, this, is this fully stuffed? It is. <laughs> I got in this like little quiet corner because there's nobody around so I can take off my mask and actually talk to everybody. I am at a really sick gym out here in Vancouver called Fitness World. This gym is sick and I'm so happy to get the legs pumping back up because, well, my friend wants to go on a hike today in Vancouver, like up in the middle of nowhere, like in the forest. And I'm like, after leg day, girly, I don't even think I'll make it like one step forward up that hill. We're First in night, City. touchdown. Night we're we here. are headed to the banter yeah. room. This is the, the turnover awesome. This is the party, the three of us. Yeah, we're here celebrating our man boy, Jimmy. 27. You know, every year. Toronto, 2021, you know, it just gets better by the year. Cheers. Happy birthday. Happy birthday, Jimmy Jam. <laughs> Yvonne bought us the soccer balls. <laughs> Go. And then yours. Go. The Dior. <laughs> the Haki Saki. The Haki Saki. <laughs> Yo, you mm. I could genuinely make love to this. We just got in the Uber and nothing like the two biggest guys sitting in the n little tiniest middle king cranny. Look at, look at this! Look at this! Ah! Okay, we're off to the bridge today. Yeah, we're going to the bridge today. The the space bridge. Bridge. We're going to the bridge today, the, the one that everybody goes to in the woods. George, are you gonna give us a house tour? Oh, you're are you vlogging? Hey guys, it's a pleasure to have you um, in my habitat. As you can see, I implemented this beautiful infinity pool in the in the rear end of my how my, much did this cost my property. This was a lot of money. It probably came up to like three ninety nine. I wanted to make it like I want to say elegant, but in the woods, like a man in the woods. Mama, 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 mama. Yo, Google's got me hyped, thinking there was like turtles, but the only thing that there there is is like leeches. <laughs> Get out me swamp! Donkey! Get out me swamp! Donkey! Be better out than in I always say, right, Donkey? Bella. Jacob. Bella, have you seen Edward? Jacob. Where are you? Edward!
We're going to a really, uh, I'd like to say bougie restaurant tonight, which is fine because I could just wear like a black shirt and some oh, dress vlogging? pants. I'm vlogging right now, yeah. Um, Ivana, on the other hand, says she wants to go like this. No, I'm looking like a train wreck. <laughs> a train wreck? Babe, more like a plane crash. <laughs> okay, so Victoria's first time trying an oyster today. Are you putting it in my mouth? No. You're doing your oyster. Go on. Wait, you didn't eat it. Oh, I need to eat that? Oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> she goes like, ah, oh, that was delicious. <laughs> yeah, she's like the yummiest thing I've ever had in my life. Actually eat it, it's time. Chew on it. Chew, chew, chew. Don't chew, just swallow. Okay, you're putting it back to the shell. <laughs> We love the little arugula. Nothing like it. George's favorite. Can you zoom in? Zoom in. I don't. I don't know. Wait, how. Aren't people still coming? Don't have that. That's poor. Well, I have it. <laughs> Hello everyone. Oh. George has brought these fucking pants on the trip because he hasn't tried them on in a few months and you know he gained the quarantine 15. So every dinner when you gain the quarantine 15 and you have to sit with your pants and undone. But when you can stand up with the buttons up and sit down with the buttons undone. Top of the morning everyone. Oh, let me try and show you the airplane. I don't know if you can see that. I have arrived to Vancouver Airport headed home kind of sad because you know i got back into the routine of going to the gym every morning working out get big get strong and now i'm going back to look like a shrimp because the gyms are not closed or they are closed sorry where i live anyways i just wanted to give an update at the airport of how i felt working out a month in on my cycle now that i'm back at the gyms unfortunately because we're in lockdown at home so everything's closed it felt amazing the best thing about it is that i write down all my workouts like on my phone so that way when i get to the gym i know like boom 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 this machine second machine third machine this workout this workout and then i'm like out within an hour and a half at all my workouts i always write at the bottom extra workouts in case i have time or i have the energy to do a couple more workouts normally i don't get around to doing them because i i, I go you know i'm pretty fast at like doing the the main ones but this entire trip i was able to do all those extra workouts that i never get to do because i have all that energy i have that strength in me and i have the ability to continue but i definitely when i got to the gym i was so happy because i was i started to like add more plates and add more weights because i knew that i could i had the ability to like lift heavier anyways i'm at my gate see you in toronto